local chef Willie Holmes joins us with a look at some dessert trends. Good morning, yes, sir. Thank you Welcome. so much. Thank you for having me. Before we get into all of this, okay. I want to ask you, I hear that you have a book coming out. I do. I do. You're calling it a cookbook novel. Absolutely. What do you mean by that? Listen, it's the first of its kind. It's an autobiography cookbook. It describes my entire life through food, um, from my childhood, through high school, to becoming an adult, and then where I am today. You know, growing up on the south side of Houston, it was not easy, right, you yeah. know? And so it's just giving away all of my little secrets, how I made it out, <laughs> and how I made it to where I am today. Oh, you I know? love that. I love so that. It's really exciting. I know you're really busy this holiday season, and going into the new year, you're also busy gearing up for the third annual Baker's Guild Awards. Yes, yes, what yes. What can you yes. share with us? This Listen, is exciting. The Baker's Guild Awards is going to be bigger than ever coming in 2024. You know, just a little bit of last year's just some of those awards. This is an award show that honors the top chefs, bakers, pastry chefs, and caterers in the community. Oh, wow. You know, um, last year we had some great winners like Chef Shannon Toome won Chef of the Year. We had Rebecca Mason won Pastry Chef of the Year. World Catering Baker was the Bakery of the Year. So it's those kind of awards. Yeah. It's taking the superlatives, but like on the chef culinary yeah. level and highlight, highlight honoring all of Houston. The competition is hot here oh, in Houston. Oh, it definitely is. We have This is one city that has some of the most amazing yeah. chefs and bakers out here, you know? I would um, argue the food scene is not matched. It's unmatched here in absolutely. Houston. Absolutely. Absolutely. Okay, talk oh to God. us. Bring Listen. us through what we have here today. Listen, desserts are trending. You know, this is this is like Mariah Carey said, it's time. <laughs> okay, we're, it's time for us as bakers as well, you right. know? <laughs> but um, the desserts can get costly, you know? Yeah. So I wanted to show some cool holiday dessert trends that um, people can kind of make and make it really easy without you know? breaking the without, bank absolutely yeah. absolutely um so right now you know outside of presentation uh desserts like i said assortment is super in right now mm -hmm. um and what you want to do is instead of buying like seven or eight desserts, take one dessert and transform that one dessert oh, into multiple idea. desserts. Yeah. So listen, I have a setup right here, some really cool desserts. One of my favorite of all time is cheesecake. If you know me, you know I love cheesecake. Hello? Yeah. Um, <laughs> so with this being said, I took one traditional plain cheesecake and we're just gonna turn it into multiple different flavors. Okay. You know, so we have some crushed Oreos, bananas and wafers to do some banana flavored. We have some strawberries if we wanna go down that route. And the best part of it is desserts. You know, just have fun with it. Let's just dig in, put some Toppings on some, and then we make some okay. desserts to complete our buffet. I'm not going to anything because I have not washed my. It's oh, been a minute. nice. So, so I you know how to this morning, but I've been on. I've been touching the clicker, and I so I don't. Oh, the whole time. Yeah. Listen, so. that, that's that's all good. You know, just okay. sprinkle right over the top. So you, I love this because, like you said, it's it's one. The, the base is the same. Absolutely. But the variety comes with the toppings. Absolutely. Yeah. You can go with different up, right? toppings, different sauces over there. You mm -hmm. know. Mm-hmm. Choose some over the top. You what got some strawberry here? in front of you, some chocolate, white chocolate, chocolate sauce. dressing. That's the beauty of it, you know, assortment. And in that way, a little bit of everything gets, everybody gets a little bit of everything. Yeah. You know, that's yeah, the beauty absolutely. of it. Absolutely. Oh, white chocolate. White chocolate. Yeah. You, know, you, gotta, you gotta have it. You gotta have that, you know? Delicious. How, um, and you know, what I really love about this too is, you know, we talked about this being affordable, but this is also something you can do uh, with your with your children, you Absolutely. know, incorporating the family to, to help you create these Absolutely. desserts. Absolutely, you know, just bringing them all to life, making them look really good for everybody. You know, that's the beauty of it. You can do so many different flavors. You know, if you look over here, I'm making some banana flavored with caramel, um, you know, fosters yeah. or pudding, depending yeah, on which way right? you like, which way you like them. <laughs> um, over there, you were doing some chocolate I don't sauce. Know. Don't, don't judge this stuff. <laughs> you can clearly see. I was like, sir, you just gave up, <laughs> clearly. <laughs> no, that's all good. It's Doctor all good. it up. We're it's just going to fix it all up, you know? But you know what? This is good. You know you got to have a little plane up in there. Right, so that's, yeah. That actually works out really good. Put some pecans on Basic. there. Basic. Easy and simple, you yes. know? And then once you finally put it over here, you know, you get your display together. And that's what's the next thing that's trending right now, you guys, a dessert display. We're not doing the standard setups anymore. We're just a three-tier and put it out there. You guys, even if you're buying desserts from the store, you know, hand-touched is the new homemade because grandmothers are 40 these days, so they're not baking no more. <laughs> not at all, not at all. She's relaxing with her feet up, yeah. Absolutely. Yeah. So that's the best part. And you know what, when everything that's really come trending, fresh florals, it candles, easy sorter, but then you also gotta add a little excitement. My favorite thing to do is just kind of turn Ooh, on the, look at that. turn it on for you, you know? Yes. Give us a full presentation. That dry ice is that's always gonna set off your your holiday dessert table. Make it alive, bring it to the light, you know, and just have a good time with it. I love desserts, it's yes. so fun. So what fun. is there not to love about Listen, desserts, right? Tell me about it. This tell week is all it. about the sweets. Well, we so much appreciate you coming in, uh, Chef Willie Holmes. Thank you very much for, for your time. Absolutely. I'm, I'm really excited. The book is going to be released on Christmas Day, Secrets of a Texas Chef. And, uh, yeah, it'll be available online. Happy so holidays to you, right? Merry Christmas That's to it. you.